Greetings all, Frog here. Let's play. GeoGuessr, this is Jobo Challenge with a three minute timer. It's a world challenge. I don't believe there was any particular theme. I do apologize. The last theme was supposed to have text written uh, or read with it. So I'm, I'm working on, on what I'm going to do with that, whether it's just going to be a comment in the last video or what I'm going to do. But something will happen. That work will be rewarded. So thank you for your patience there. I don't see any notes for this one. So I'm hoping this actually has no notes. And if this one has notes, well, then we'll add them afterwards somewhere too. Here we go. World Challenge, three minutes. Vehicle drop off at green curb only. No stopping at the red curb. Red curb is for loading and unloading only. Don't give me any of that red zone. All right, a little airport joke for her. Airplane joke, sorry, sorry. Airport's a very different movie. Lars Hansen Drive, which is 800 East. It appears that we are in, uh, perhaps Utah? Perhaps Utah. At the military science building of something. The logo is too small for me to read. No, it's not. Utah State University. It's the big, big, it's the big blue. It's the big blue terrace. Right, we're at 700 and 800, wherever Utah State is. The Utes. Actually, I think it's Utah. <laughs> don't kill me. I don't know. Um, Utah is in Boise. No, Boise State is in Boise. Where is Utah State? You know what? I shouldn't be on this thing yet. Get out of the way! Get out of the way! I only have three minutes. I don't know what city Utah, the, the Utah State is in, so we got to figure that out first. But we're, we're definitely on the campus of Utah State. There's the University of Utah, there's Utah State, there's Boise State. Three residential campuses. Logan, Price, or Blanding? Well, we have three choices, so there you go. Logan, Pier Price, Price? I think it's Price, or Blanding. Logan. Logan. Logan's way up here. 700. And 800. Lars Hansen Drive. Okay, there we go. Don't even have to look at the other ones. Logan must be main campus. They're Aggies as well. Nice. Excellent. Only one point away. 19 meters. When Kiro Kijosoki and Pese Spirakoski. Peche? Oh, it's all Greek to me. Which would be hilarious if we're actually in Greece, but I don't think we are. It would be hilarious, though. It does have a vaguely European feel to it. What are we selling here? Flowers? Okay. 9th of September, so street. Cage would be like street or way or lane or something. I'm guessing. Damn it. Stokovna. Something. It's a Cyrillic speaking country where the streets in GeoGuessr at Macedonia. I say have been transliterated into English. Wasn't Macedonia the place where people said that they don't speak or they don't use Cyrillic much anymore? Or am I going crazy? I must be going crazy because that advert is full of Cyrillic. I'm not sure how to find where I am in Macedonia in an hour or a minute and 41 seconds. In an hour and 41 minutes, I could do it. But in a, <laughs> in a minute and 41 seconds, I'm not so sure. What are these? Rustica? Rustic? Are those rolls or donuts or something? I'm on board if they're donuts. If they're just rolls, I'm not that interested. I shouldn't, though. I really shouldn't. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have a tough time adjusting. Um, I was, I was diagnosed as diabetic the last time I went to my doctor, so probably should cut back on things like donuts. Um, my view is that I could still have some because, you know, you do need sugar to survive. I just got to cut back on the total amount of sugar, so maybe I have half a donut instead of a whole donut. You know what? I don't want to do that because I'm going to run out of time looking at the timer, so let's just do this. Get, get myself down into Macedonia. And just say we're in Skopje, outside of it, because I think that's where most of the cameras are anyway. 
We were in prep. Prelep. We were in prelep. I know a prelep, actually. It's hilarious. The old clock tower. Save the clock tower. Wish I could have seen it. Save the clock tower. Damn it! What have I told you about Cyrillic? Now, luckily, one of them says we're 350 kilometers from Ulaanbaatar. And I know where Ulaanbaatar is. We're 38 kilometers from Kujirt and Karkorin. Does that mean we're in? Yeah, it kind of does look like we're in the steppes of Mongolia, doesn't it? The steppes of Mongolia. It's a rock band, I think. Ulaanbaatar. Oh, I didn't even bother to look what direction it's in. It is north of us. Okay. Ulaanbaatar. I don't know how far 350 kilometers is. Wait, wait, I remember. 1.6 kilometers to a mile. So it's approximately 200 miles. So we're looking like in this sort of area. Perfect. <laughs> so what else? What else am I looking for? Kartkorin and Kujirt. Okay. Mm Kartkorin and Kujirt. Okay, zooming in did not give me any additional cities, so good. It's actually easier for me to pattern match on the Cyrillic than it is the English, which is sort of strange. I'm not finding it anyway. I don't think we're way over here. That just seems like a long distance. Like, that's way more than 200 miles, I think. Well, I know it's 180 miles. That's about 180 miles. Yeah, yeah, so... I think I'm, I'm kind of looking in the right kind of area. Yeah, I mean, you know, somewhere down there somewhere. It's not too bad. 621 kilometers. It's way closer than I thought. That's not... S oh, I see. Up this tiny little road. And then it's due east. So that's 200 miles. That's like 300 miles. It's miles to kilometers, man. This is neat. We're on Collingwood Puponga Road. Collingwood P Puponga Main Road. That sounds New, Ze New Zealand esque. This looks New Zealand esque. Maybe a little flatter than I would expect. Maybe this is like Southern Australia. Oh, wait a minute. That kind of implied we were driving on the right there, what I saw a second ago. Maybe that was a passing sign. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're definitely driving to the left. Get me the road signs. Give me the luck of the nighty. For those of you who just started watching, nighty is a person, not a negligee. Although if I had that kind of power too, I would rule the world. And not like control over other people's negligee. I, I would have one and it would be amazing. And that's how I would rule the world. Obviously. We just crossed a river. We've used half of our time already. We haven't even seen one road sign. Beautiful landscape. Crossed another river. Here's some road signs. They're not helpful ones. Farewell spit. Oh good, Collingwood. What a shocker. Settlers Museum. These look like Australian signs. We are now on Collingwood Bainham Ro Main Road. All signs point to Collingwood. Okay. There's like big camping regions of something. 
Oh, New Zealand it is. Never mind. Takaka is on the 60 in New Zealand. 60 regional. 60, 60, 60, 60. It's on the South Island. There's 60. There's Takaka. There's Collingwood. Collingwood, Pakaka, Kawawa, Para, Para. I don't remember which one we were on. Oh, Pupunga. Yeah, it was Collingwood, Pupunga Road. Yeah, so we started like here-ish. Cross the big river, then cross the other river. I'm happy with that. Two kilometers away. Could have been better. We're on the other side of the inlet. Sneaky. Alright, I'm still happy with that. It's location 5 already. It's a tropical location. Jimmy Charles. See inside dot in. Look at all these different things we can go to. This is a golf course. GF. Golf. Front. I don't know. LB. No smoking, no swimwear. Seems reasonable. Sea Cliff Resort and Spa, Zanzibar. Is that really Zanzibar? It is. We're in Zanzibar. KD. Tom and Jerry, apparently. It's the kids. Ah, kids. LB, I don't know. JT. That's a lot of side things. This is a great advertisement here for this uh, Sea Cliffs in Zanzibar. Is Zanzibar safe? Can we go to Zanzibar? Garden U. It's a work workout facility. Okay. I want to say like a room. Like this is all very nice, but if your rooms are already been there. Here we go. Jambo. That's not bad. A little balcony stuff. That's actually kind of nice. It's deluxe. Playing some bocce out there, some charades or, or not charades. Um, I mean charades, yeah. But what I mean to say, that's a conference center. CF BR. Whoa! Look at that pool. Look at that pool. We gotta go. We gotta go here for sure. Yeah, the beach sucks, but I don't care. Um, anyway, we're in Zanzibar. Um, do do do. Sea cliffs. I don't know if this is like on an island or the main part of Zanzibar. We could probably figure out if we looked hard, far enough. It's Chinese embassy. Protea Hotel. Zanzibar Mweni Ruins. It's a Marriott. Island Sea View. Sea Cliffs was the one. A lot of resorts in uh, Zanzibar. I don't know. We're in Zanzibar. Oh, whoa. Way north. Sea Cliff Resort and Spa. Cool. That was uh, a very nice world challenge. Quite a diverse set of locations. Uh, from Utah to New Zealand and back again. Very neat. Uh, thank you so much for providing it. Of course, if you'd like to do your own, no problem. Just head on over to geoserve.ml, put in five locations, and then send me the link, and I will play the challenge. Thanks again, Joe, for sending this one in. It was very enjoyable. Hopefully, you guys liked it as well. If you did, click the like button, subscribe to the channel to stay updated to everything that happens. Until next time, cheers.